Victoria. Words cannot describe how happy I am to be standing here about to become your husband. Here in this wonderful setting, I cannot think of a more fitting way to begin our married life together. I'm so lucky to have shared the last eight or so years with you. You're a wonderful person, you're beautiful, and today you look absolutely stunning. <laughs> I wrote that obviously before, but I cannot believe how stunning you actually are. You are also so clever, kind, caring, and dare I say, even funny for a girl. <laughs> Above all, you're my best friend, someone I can depend on, someone who I can share my life with and be my true self around. We have the most wonderful memories together and I look forward to making many more with you through our marriage, even if you have to drag me to places I don't want to go, as you do know me better than I know myself. It's been a long journey to this point, and perhaps longer than it should have been, <laughs> but I'm so excited for our life together. I promise that in our marriage, I'll be at least as good as I've been for the last eight years. <laughs> I love you. Victoria and Chris, today you embark on the wild and wonderful adventure of marriage. Nothing else matters right now except relaxing into this moment and enjoying every second. Adventure is what truly makes you both the happiest. And exciting news, marriage can be just that for the two of you. An adventure that brings you closer, that daily reminds you just how lucky you are to have each other. It's so hard to explain how I feel about you. So difficult to put into words what I want to vow to you as we become husband and wife. But words aren't enough. The way I feel about you is different, like the build-up in your chest as you belt out a song that you know every word to, or that serendipitous feeling of hearing your favorite song unexpectedly. That moment where everything you planned goes exactly to plan. It's a feeling that even though I'm lucky enough to have lived and visited so many incredible countries, I never really felt what homesick is like until I felt what it was like to not be with you. They say that building a love on easy ground is strong, but I know that building it through hard times is what makes it impossible to break and indestructible. When Tom got sick and later died, you were my rock. You held my hand and you healed a heart that you hadn't broken. And you somehow managed to piece together every damaged shard Every time I think about our future, I remember the patience and the kindness that you've had and the gentleness, and I think about how on earth did I get so lucky. If I could have created the perfect man, I don't think I would have even come close to what fate has led me to with you. These past nearly eight years have shown me time and time again that your kindness and gentleness is more important. You are by far the best person I've ever met. You inspire me to be better in almost every way. I can't promise you a lifetime of easy days and calm seas, but I can promise you today that I will never stop loving you. Victoria Stone and Christopher Dean, this is it. This is the moment you have been waiting for. This is the moment you become husband and wife.